Now that your fixture has been removed and your shower arm is clean and ready to go, it's time to install Teflon tape. Pretty much anywhere you look on the internet or anyone that knows home improvement will tell you the same thing and they will all tell you to wrap the Teflon tape clockwise. If the purpose of Teflon tape is simply to provide a little lubrication and prevent corrosion in this joint, clockwise is fine and it will work. I'm going to suggest that it might be better to wrap the Teflon tape counterclockwise because there's a third and more important purpose for the Teflon tape and that is that it will be sacrificed and cut into as we apply it. It's not removable and reusable and part of that sacrifice will be when we wrap it counterclockwise and we install the fixture clockwise part of that sacrifice will be to make little bunches and it will bunch up inside the threads and those little bunches will fill in every gap and every space and help to prevent leaks. So uh, if you don't believe this feel free to wrap clockwise. However, if you don't want any leaks I highly recommend that you wrap counterclockwise and I'll demonstrate right now how that can be done. You start the Teflon tape pretty flat and you press it down into the threads and overlap it and then you want to put several layers and the older your plumbing is the more wraps you're going to want, 5, 6, 7, 8, even 10 or 12, you almost can't have too much. Then simply pull it tight like that, snap it off, and then again using that counterclockwise motion you want to press this down into the threads so that it won't unravel but in, in fact will shred up and make little micro bunches filling all the voids when you install your product. So now that the Teflon tape has been applied, you're ready to install your new and upgraded shower product.